What's up guys, Bionicle Byron is back again with another Transformers video review. I am, I extremely apologize for taking too long to review this figure. I bet a lot of you have been looking forward to seeing this video from me and like, I haven't gotten around to it and I really do apologize for that. I've been really busy and my black camera broke over the week. And I had other fi I had another figure that I was actually just gonna surprise you with, and my black camera just completely broke. Like it 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 refuses to even turn on, and I'm kind of upset about that. But I am getting a new one, so yeah. Woo! -hoo. Um. Anyways, um, I'm gonna split this kind of into three sections. One tiny section for him, one tiny section for this little thing, which by the way, this thing is actually pretty cool, and one giant section for him. So, let's get started. Um, to get the lamest part out of the way, here is Captain Lennox. Smaller than your average G.I. Joe, never really liked G.I. Joe, and I don't really care for the humans. They are really lame. Yeah. I don't like him. Now, the bike I wasn't so sure on because I was kind of expecting it to become some kind of fembot. But you know, this is actually really cool because this actually becomes the gun. If you haven't already seen a video on this guy. Because you know, this is my video. And yeah, that's the bike. And it kind of rolls with that gigantic missile as the smoke pipe. Now the real meat of the video. Jazz. This figure, purely amazing. Just, I love the way this figure is engineered. Jazz has always been one of my favorite characters. Like, you could probably tell how much I love Jazz himself as a character in Transformers from my Reveal the Shield review because in my Reveal the Shield review I was so excited because I found because I finally found him and just I'm at like Jazz is one of my absolute favorites and you know this is actually a really nice version of Jazz I'm actually really really impressed with this one um so yeah I'm not even gonna ask the question at robot mode, would Bionicle Combiners recommend Human Alliance Jazz? Absolutely. This is amazing. If you don't already have this figure, find it. Even if you have to get it on clearance, find it, pick it up, try it out. It is amazing. So, enough of my ranting. Let's transform them all. Now, to transform them, what you're going to do is you're going to take this back spoiler or you know what no first off you're gonna open the doors like that and then this whole piece kind of comes up and then the, you kind of got to reach underneath to pop this off or you know what Hold on. before you do that you're actually gonna pull this out and this is actually gonna help you free that up free that up and then once you get that all hunky dory, you're gonna flip this leg panel up like that. Um, you're gonna separate it. You're gonna pull out the entire leg. This little heel piece you're gonna flip back, which of course he doesn't really need it. But you know, it's there for transformation reasons. Some, and, you know, you don't have to do that if you don't want to, but, you know, it's there for transformation. Yeah. Now, there's actually a couple options for these. Now, a lot of people just leave them back there. Some leave, it ba leave them back there and twist them. Now, what I do, if I can get this to work, is I flip them around until they click. And then, yeah, there we go. 
like that. Now, get the camera up because the the upper body is actually a little more of a complicated beast. Now, what you're gonna do for the upper body? Whoops! Is you're actually going to well make sure all this is flipped down like that, and then this whole piece. Well, you're gonna you're gonna flip this up like that to kind of help free it. And then this piece comes down. Well, before you do that, you're gonna come up, up in here and pull his arms down like these. This is gonna come down, rotate around. And then there's this little ab piece that flips out. And then this. Come on, really? There we go. It just tabs right into place. And then the rest of it really is just. You pull this out and you twist it. These actually angle up. These you kind of got to angle up by collarbones. Like at that. Flip this back a little more and then come in here and flip up his head and then you turn it around obviously now for the arms you're actually going to twist them around like this flip out his hand and then just close this part up it's kind of hard to do because it kind of just gets stuck there but once you get it going it actually just folds up nice and flush and then just separate his fingers and give him those really weird grabby hands that's the only kind of design that's the only part of, the, of his design that I kind of didn't like was the whole weird little grabby hand things but anyways yeah there is human alliance jazz in robot mode and I think the robot mode is where he really shines. Because this figure is absolutely amazing. I'm just wow. Blown. I'm usually not bl absolutely blown away with figures. This is the first figure where I'm literally going to admit I was blown away with it. Now one of the one of the craziest gimmicks that I that at first when I saw pictures I didn't think this was this was actually gonna gonna work out but when you fold up his hand you can actually see this little hole right there the bike like I mentioned turns turns into a gun you're gonna take off the missile you're gonna extend it right there you're gonna flip out this little connection piece right here and then this whole piece is going to flip back. Whoops. And then these pieces come out like that. And then the whole thing just kind of fold in half like that. Oh, and the wheel actually folds up and into there. To kind of hold, hold everything into place. And there you go. There's the gun and the gun just attaches to his arm like that and they and some say to just flip the window up I actually just kind of angle that whole piece up and there you go it's actually a pretty freaking big gun put the missile in and there you go that just looks really freaking cool I'm really impressed with this figure I just wow if you don't already have this figure, pick him up. He is awesome. And, you know, again, he's, like, if you flip this down, you got the seat for the human to sit on. He's got the little little gun right here that, that are on his knees. And he's got this little gun up here. And one of the things I didn't even notice for the longest time, he's got a, he's got a little seat up here that the guy can sit in. So yeah, that said, Human Alliance Jazz.
I know you guys have been waiting a long time for this figure to be reviewed. And, well, yeah, there you go. Um, since he's part of the figure, yeah. Uh, Human Alliance Jazz. Oh, before I go, um, a quick size comparison. Uh, here is Skirt. Oh, crap, he's not good. But, you know, yeah, there you go. There, That's pretty much how big he is compared to Irish Deluxe figures. With that said, this is Bonner, Bonner signing out.